likely tornado. That's what we're calling it for now. The National Weather Service still has to come out and survey this damage, but we saw the rotation. We had a couple pictures come in where you could see the clouds uh, descending towards the ground. So this is likely a tornado. Not sure exactly the damage yet. Maybe EF1, EF2. We'll have to see what the National Weather Service uh, indicates later. Their crews are coming in from Tulsa. Uh, well, right now, this is a look at the Nilfisk uh, Center where they actually make industrial cleaning equipment, floor cleaning equipment. And so this receiving area has been completely destroyed. The shipping there on the other side, almost untouched, but the path likely came here on the south side of Springdale, actually right next to the airport. Uh, but damage is extensive. We've got semi-tractor trailers that have been rolled over. Uh, there's actually a vehicle over here. Was it parked here? One of the employees that was here earlier this morning during the tornado was parked a little bit farther down, but the car was moved. Every single window's been blown out except for one. Uh, all the metal you see wrapped around the trees, wrapped around the car, wrapped around different light poles. Some of the light poles are actually leaning at this point. Shows that damage that ripped off of this building and has been just blown here by a hundred yards or so in the distance. But as soon as the National Weather Service has their crews out and officially releases what damage this is, what rating this tornado, likely a tornado, has been given, we're going to get that information to you guys as soon as possible. But we've had roofs ripped off homes, we've got schools damaged, and of course we've got our local businesses that are not untouched as well. So we're going to continue to give you updates and we'll let you know what the damage report is as soon as it's available.